What's going on, world? It's your boy, Big Chips. Listen, today, uh, I don't know. Today, I'm going to be coming off with uh, not a rant or I guess just mainly questions. But uh, there's so much drama that's going on online right now. You know, between friends, between companies, between everything in between. And it's actually just rather funny because you know, last week, even, all right, we'll just say last week we had people raving about their company and how awesome it is, look how great I'm doing, and now they're singing the praises of another company. You know, which kind of is funny in a way because it, you know, how can you do that? I mean, I know, th I know there's a lot of great opportunities out there, but I mean, how can one day you be all about this company and you are not interested at all at any other opportunity and then all of a sudden you're in another opportunity singing the praise of that so it just, it's a money game you know some people are real leaders some people are just after the money and it's very very prevalent to me because i actually watch what people do you know, I want to see if they're serious about their business, if they're actually being honest about their feelings of X, Y, Z. But we got a lot of awesome leaders that are out there that just decide that they want to go a different route, you know? And that's cool too. So I got a few questions that I actually want you to comment on, all right? And tell me your thoughts, really. But number one, is to the fake leaders, all right? These are the people who don't really have their own voice. All they do is copy and paste what everybody else does. What are your thoughts on that? What are your thoughts on just stealing everybody else's stuff and then putting it out there in the world, whether it be by video, by email, by Facebook, by whatever. Now, I understand that some of us, it's okay to get swiped, you know? Swipe is one thing, you know, change out the links, change out some verbiage. I mean, you should always change it out. I don't give a crap what it is, what kind of swipe you're getting. You should change it out to put it in your language because each person is something different, right? So, you know, what are your thoughts on that? You know, people who just take everybody else's work and then claim it as their own. Second would be, what do you think about these people who lash out at program offers, but yet they've been in like three different opportunities in the past six, seven months. <laughs> oh God, man, these people, I swear to God. You know, I don't know I shouldn't do that, but you know, I swear. It's funny how people will lash out at people, you know, and you see it on Facebook a lot. People will lash out at their former company or they'll lash out at people who hop around. They'll do all this crap, but yet they're just as bad as everything that they're they're complaining about. You know, even me, I'll complain about crap that bothers me, but then I stop and I look and I'm like, oh crap, I did that. <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's, it's nature of the beast for something to bother you about someone else that bothers you about yourself, right? But blatantly, mind you, blatantly raging out on folks, and yet you do exactly what you're raging out on. <laughs> oh man, it's a day today. But I mean, seriously, guys, I, I, I would love some feedback on this, you know, because I, I know how I feel. And I'm going to be starting the new show coming up shortly and uh, going to have a lot of good guests coming on that are going to help to, I don't know. My my joy is just talking, as I, obviously, right? I, I, <laughs> your boy loves to talk. But I like to I like to talk to people. I like to find out what it is they're doing, how it is they're doing it, what what they think makes it work good. You know, some of them make it work great. <laughs> you know, but what makes it work good? And 
really just dive into the mechanics of how do you get through the bullcrap of this industry? How do you get through the people who always talk the loudest but do the least? Or they talk the most about how great they are, but then all they're actually doing is hurting people. You know, it, it's, it's a very weird place we live in. Very weird. You know, and this industry can be dirty in so many ways. And you see so many people that are out there screaming, look at me, look at me, look at me, here's my picture, glorify me, I'm so great, I'm so awesome. But nothing that they're doing is original. There's nothing that they're doing that is theirs, that's their work, that's their words, that's their anything, <laughs> you know? It's something that they stole from somebody else or something that they, you know, tried to copy from somebody else and it's very blatantly obvious because they miss out on the majority of the stuff that should be talked about. So, there you go. Can't really say it's a rant, but it's a rant, but I really want to know some feedbacks, some what your thoughts are on the matter. So leave them on the comments below and just, I don't know, man. It, it's such a crazy thing that I sit here and watch. Such a wide burst amount of people and people that could be great, but then they aren't great. It's crazy. All right, so there you go. There's my daily video, my rant for the day. This has been your moment with Big Chips, and we are here to keep it real. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? We here to keep it real. So uh, I'm excited, man. I got a, I got a lot of good stuff getting ready to come out, and a lot of stuff that is getting ready to change some things. So I'm looking forward to it. So until then, it's your boy Big Chips. Here representing the Diamond Dream Team, Simple Freedom Lifestyle. You know, we're just waking them up. That's all we can do. That's all we can do. So make it a great day. I dare you.